Hey everybody, it's Jerry Gonzalez here. Thank you for watching this video in which I'm going to go over a few things that people ask me. First of all, one, what mic do you use? And two, how do you get clean audio? And I'm going to answer the second one by showing you how I edit my videos audio-wise, uh, which is actually not, I don't even know if it's called editing. It's kind of just, you know, substituting audio. That's, that's really what it is. Okay, so first of all, my mic. I use the Blue Yeti mic right here. Okay, the yeah, the Blue Yeti. Uh, this isn't, you know, anything too special. It's just a USB condenser microphone, and it works really, really well, and I really like it. Um, and the second question, how do I record my audio? Basically, what you're listening to right now is the audio from the camera. Okay, and you can hear how it's not that, I mean, it's, it's okay, but it's not that good. Now, the audio that you're hearing right here is the Blue Yeti mic, and I'm going to show you how I edited that right now. Okay, and just to show you guys how I set up my microphone, um, there's probably a better spot for it, but what I do with my tech update videos is I'll actually place it between my legs so it's right under me and then I face the condenser microphone up to me. And that way when I talk, I mean, you it, it picks everything up, but uh, you know it's not in the scene. It's kind of distracting when you can see the microphone in the scene, in my opinion. So, I mean... So, for some setups, it looks nice when you can see the mic, and some setups it doesn't. And in my case, I don't like my I don't like being being able to see the microphone in the video, and um, it's just the way it works. So, anyways, let's get to the editing part and let's see how it looks. Okay, so we're right here on my computer now, and you can see right here I used the program called Audacity Audacity to record the audio part. Okay, so all I did is went to File or Edit Preferences um, Recording. You can see my Yeti stereo microphone right there. And I clicked OK, and it recorded it nice. And there's the clip. And all I did was I went ahead, and you can either export as a WAV or MP3. And it is now on my desktop right there. OK. So I saved up my audio. And now what I'm going to do is insert my memory card from my camera into my computer really quick. Great. And let's open that to view files and folders and stuff. Bring that off my second screen. Here's the video. I'm going to drag that to my desktop. And all right, so now my uh, video clip is right here. It's all ready to go and edit. And I have my audio. I have my video. OK, now I'm going to open up Sony Vegas, and which is what I used to edit my videos. And I'm going to go ahead and drag both of these video and audio files into the project media bin basically or section of the program and I'm gonna double click my video to drop to uh, drop it in there and drag the audio in as well and basically this is how I do it it's really simple I select the part I zoom in really close so I can see the audio and I just drag uh, this audio to match and then what I'll do is I'll play it and try it out hey everyone it's Jerry Gonzalez here thank alright and it sounds pretty uh, in sync what I'll do is get a part before the video, press S to split it, go down here, split, split, delete those parts, right click this audio, group, remove from, which is the audio from the video, delete that, and drag this one up. I'll control click to highlight um, both of them, make sure they're both see, highlighted, control click, highlight, right click, group, and create new. Now they are attached. And that's basically how I do it. And I can delete this extra audio track there. And there we go. Hey everyone, it's Jerry Gonzalez here. Thank you for... So that's the audio cleaned up there. Okay. Um, that's pretty much how I do it. All right, so thank you for watching this video. Maybe you're new at YouTube. You, you know, you're making your first videos or something. But now you know how to dub audio pretty much. You know how to put audio over a video clip and make the audio more clean. The trick is to basically just sync it up. That's it in the editing program, and you're good to go. So, again, thank you for watching this video. Please thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.